The fact that Megan is moving like Beyonce is sending me. She said, even with the odds against me, I found myself. The Heidi's fought for me. Rock Nation fought for me. I'm forever grateful. She said, I'm I maintain my independence as an artist and own my masters in publishing. Ciao. And the fact that allegedly Nikki has the real beef with Rock Nation, which I'm wondering why she's not going at the Rock Nation herself and going through Meg. But maybe somebody can explain that to me. But the fact that she got beef with Rock Nation and Rock Nation made sure she kept her masters and her publishing is huge. It was the, this is the first deal of its kind. I hope artists still on the come up or even artists who have already established never get discouraged by the obstacles that come with the industry. She knows how to keep her brands and still check somebody. And that's going to keep her in the long game for sure. She say hashtag hot girl productions, y'all. I am in tears. Because Nikki is very upset about how her distribution is going, how she feels like people behind the scenes are doing other things. But this is my thing. You've been in the game for 20 years. Is it your team that you're just picking the wrong team? Because at the end of the day, if you pick the wrong team and the wrong people around you, that does affect your career. That's for anybody. So I'm wondering, like... Is it her team that's just not doing the things that they need to do to make sure she's in these positions? Or is she saying that they're trying to, but she's getting shunned out? I'm trying to get both sides here. That's all. But this right here, I love the way Megan is handling it. She's not responding to the rants. She's just keeping it in the music while still focused on her deals. I'm here for it.